Thank you. We just came to explore and give our son some educational purposes and see what there is to see. I'm here to watch the air show and support our fellow flights, the people who fly for us and protect us. You see, I can support them, see their work. That that really scares me. Back backflips and all that. It's <laughs> incredible. That really Most of our technology stack speaks about able to get data, data acquisitions but also leaving the people out of harm's way, right? Pe giving the people out of the danger firing line in this instance, but be able to gather the data, whether it's drones, legged robotics, sensors, any communications, ruggedized tablets, to enable them to make the decisions in the field while gathering repeatable, accurate data as often and as accurately as possible. Speaking about technology and also man's best friend, some of the work we're doing with Spot the Robot Dog from Boston Dynamics is to be able to help people to do advanced remote inspections. Right? Um, if you think about search and rescue efforts, which we see a lot in the mining sector, but also in, in kind of uh, disaster management types where the army is, also gets involved heavily, we need to be able to identify the uh, what, what risks are available in the area, but also be able to sometimes actually give some comfort to some of the victims that there is help coming. I think what makes AAD unique is the fact that it's that, it, that it's a a South African grown initiative and, and it brings international communities together. I mean we've got India, we've got um, the US, we've got UK. Uh, everybody comes together and showcases what they've got to offer. Um, and it's 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 good to see. 